Hey, and welcome back. It's been a while since I've done a sketch on this channel. Uh, my previous video you may have seen was me unboxing my new Apertura AD-12 Dobsonian telescope. So tonight is my first night actually observing with it since I got it on June 19th. And I am now going to aim it at uh, M27, the Dumbbell Nebula in the constellation Volpecula. Let's have a look in Stellarium to see where it's located and then we will get on with the sketch. M27, also known as the Dumbbell Nebula, is a planetary nebula in the constellation Volpecula. This nebula lies 1,360 light years from Earth and is around a magnitude 7. M27 covers an area of sky which is 8 by 5.6 arc seconds and has a radius of 1.44 light years. To find this object, look for it between the constellations Volpecula and Sagitta. There will be a bright magnitude 5 star named 14 Volpecula nearby. Now that we know where to find M27, let's get on with the sketch. I usually start my sketches off with the star field, but with this being my first time sketching with the Dobsonian, I felt like starting in the middle and working my way to the edge. For the nebula, I used a white pastel pencil and a smudge pencil to blend it and give it that nebulous look. Placement of the stars is a little different without a tracking mount, so I worked on the stars nearby to the nebula and other patterns I noticed in the star field. Finding shapes to the stars in the field of view really helps a lot with placement. The hardest part about sketching is getting things placed with the right distance between them. And that's about it for the sketch, let's have a look at the final drawing. I added the eyepiece view and details of the sketch in GIMP, and a few minor touch-ups like rounding out a few of the stars, and that was it for the editing. I have to say, going from an 8-inch SCT to a 12-inch Dobsonian was a great idea. The views through this telescope are beautiful, and I can't wait to do more sketches with it. With that said, I might have to try removing the restrictions of the circle for my sketches and see if that gives me a bit more room to play around. I feel like having no boundaries would allow me to also include maybe a few other objects in a single sketch for when objects are close but more than one eyepiece view, or might just be too big to fit all of it into the eyepiece view. Anyway, that about wraps up this sketch. Thank you very much for watching and clear skies.